Hello, this is Duncan Welder. I wanted to take you through the process of loading a SCORM module to the VTA system, a question that comes up pretty often, and it's a quick and easy process. What I need to do is actually import my course file. So I'm going to go to Administrator and into my course catalog, and I already have a course set up for this uh, Ingenious Pumps module but I could add that course as well. At this point, I'm just going to edit. Make sure it's self-study because I don't want to take the class lesson. And then when I go to my lessons, you see right now my list is blank. I'm going to go ahead and add that module. So I'm going to give it some kind of clever name here like module. And select the lesson type document. That's going to give me my command link application completion action boxes down at the bottom. If I change my completion action to SCORM, what that does is gives me an import button. And when I click import, that's going to actually open up a new window in Internet Explorer and tells me what my lesson number is, gives me the option to override it if there's already a lesson there. And in this case, there's not. What I'm going to do is hit browse and that lets me browse out along my network to find that module. In this case, it's again right here. So now I hit import. It's going to go do the magic that it does on that import and then will give me uh, some kind of message at the end, hopefully a success message. Um, so we'll let that process for a second there. This is a good size module with a lot of graphics and um, audio um, video inside it. So this might take a moment or two. And you see there I get my import successful actually. I'll I'm gonna scroll over to the right a little bit there and, and you can see that. So now I just close that window back. I hit OK and my lesson is there. Nothing more complicated than that. If I go back to Learner, I'm going to log in now and go out and find that guy. In this case, what I'm going to do is just search my course catalog and I know that I listed that as SCORM testing and test course and if I scroll through my list, there's my pumps module. I'm going to hit yes and now run that actual program. Now it opens up in a new window. SCORM requires the module to do. Um, and you can see I've got my loading bar there coming in. Now I would have closed that guy out because I um, didn't want to talk over the narration there. But as simple as that, I stepped through the process, going in, adding my module, selecting that, or adding my lesson, using the import function to select the module I wanted imported. SCORE modules are always going to come in a zip format. Um, and bring that over into the system, testing it out then in Learner. Of course, I'd want to go all the way through and verify that I got completion and everything there. Um, if you have any questions on this topic, importing modules or any others, never hesitate to contact us at support at risk-inc.com or www.risk-inc.com. I thank you much. Have a great day.